My name is Nicholas Jaber, uh, Nick for short. I'm running as an independent for um, ASUC president. Hello, my name is Matt Holtz. I'm running as candidate number 104. Hello, everyone. My name is Cuauhtémoc Salinas. I am running to become your next um, ASUC senator as an independent candidate. While political parties may dominate the ASUC, last year two candidates who ran without party affiliation were elected into the Senate. Will some of this year's independent candidates have the same success? Junior Nicholas Jaber is running independently for president. He claims to be an ideological alternative to the divisive identity politics that he thinks dominate the ASUC. Other platforms of his include cutting the SEC budget by 50% and instituting monthly meetings. My, my chief goal here is to get students talking about uh, fiscal oversight. Uh, the ASUC receives an astronomical sum of money every year, 75% uh, of which comes directly from our student fee money. Yet they're rarely checked. We never ask where this money's going, how it's being allocated, um, and frankly, after you take a quick look at the budget, it's pretty obvious that there's a lot of waste. Matt Holzer is a first-year student hoping to represent the entertainment community. If elected, he wants to improve upon the quantity, quality, and access to entertainment programming on campus. I strongly believe that entertainment at this school is good. I think the ACC does a good job funding it and a good job helping to run it. But I think that we can do a better job. We're the number one public school in the nation. I think that we can have number one entertainment here. Quotamok Salinas is a fourth-year student running for Senate. His platforms include reinvigorating the Health Opportunity Fund, creating a timely and efficient warning system, and increasing undergraduate-graduate collaborations. One major thing that I like to accomplish is making sure that um, undocumented Latino and also um, and also queer folks have a voice within ASCC Senate. Like I mentioned um, before, I am involved in a lot of communities and I'm involved in a lot of spaces and I feel the necessity of like not only using my voice but also amplifying it. Anything is possible when you just try, try and work hard. Running independent has not been easy, but I'm so thankful to have this tremendous support I've been receiving. And, and one of my hashtags are very, very cute. It's anything for Selena, so please come and support me. Um, um, vote for anything for Salinas number 103. All of the candidates we talked to emphasize the importance of looking beyond partisan politics this election season. We have common problems and common aspirations. Until we realize that, uh, the campus climate is frankly going to suck. Really look at the candidates who are running and really think about voting for an independent this semester, whether it's me or one of the other three independents. Good luck to all the candidates and make sure to cast your vote between April 7th and April 9th.